The whole reason we're doing these segments is to talk about obesity, to tell you the truth about what obesity is, to tell you the truth about how we combat obesity, how we treat obesity. If you follow Dr. Raz's guidelines, it's not going to happen. But Dr. Raz is not alone. He's just following along with everyone else, all of these other organizations. Dr. Oz is not alone. The vast majority of medical professionals will follow and agree with what Dr. Oz has to say. And it's just plain wrong. It's the old argumentatum ad vericundium. Once again, Dr. Oz, major personality, TV personality out there. How could Dr. Oz be wrong? How could he be wrong? Ladies and gentlemen, you know, we want to take weight off. We want to lose weight. You got to watch for the carbs, avoid the carbs, avoid the fruits and the, and, and, and the vegetables, the carrots. You got to eat more feet, uh, fat and please, well feet too because it's a protein, but please too, remember that eating fat and cholesterol is safe, that eating carbohydrates is dangerous and don't be afraid of protein. I'm Dr. Jim Carlson. Mr. This just, this just in, hold on, this just in. All right, this is from Dr. Raz's uh, uh, show. He states that losing, uh, if you lose 35 pounds, you increase your penis size by one inch. I'm reading it, you know, this is just him. You lose 35 pounds, you increase your penis size by one inch. No, Dr. Raz, you're just able to see more of it.